Um, I think I think we say we hope to win it. Um, we always felt that we've had two week gaps since the last game, and we, and we wanted to improve from that. Uh, we obviously were better second half today. The wind did play a factor in it, uh, but when you're playing sides in the bottom six, that is obviously an opportunity to to get points. Uh, I think we've all, we look at that bottom half of the table or sides in mid table without things to play for as a real opportunity for points. And uh, it's a, it is a bit of relief because there's a lot of lads in that dressing room that have probably struggled, struggled with a little bit of confidence. Um, so to get three points on the board uh, weight, lifts a bit of a weight off their shoulders. We're asking them to do things in terms of control the football a little bit better, to want the ball more. And you don't do that when you're not winning games. So the fact that we've got a win is uh, a bit of a like I say, weight lifted off their shoulders. Ultimately though, we, we did say, you know, we're not going to get too down about the Carlton defeat. We're not going to get too high about the win today. There's a lot of results around us where sides have won. So it's not a, we don't look at it as a one-off thing. We hope that that's going to build us a bit of confidence. And if it does, you know, we'll look to, to improve again the next week and look for more points. You know, there are some, every game is going to be tough between now and the end of the season. And uh, today proved that this is a side, you come here where they're not winning games regularly. But they've they put you under a lot of pressure and you can't switch off and when you do switch off you get punished the good thing for us is we used the wind uh when the chances come we took them and i thought i thought we were good value for it over the 90 minutes well, i think you, you look at tiago and uh, as an example he we know what his skill set is he's very good one on one he's very good dribbling players and first half we didn't get him the football he also needed to be bigger and stronger because it was a scrappy game first half. We were against the wind. And sometimes players players like him, against the wind, you don't get it to his feet. Second half got to his feet, he caused some problems. He's created two goals today. Uh, we know he doesn't what he does give us is an attacking threat. We know defensively that's not his strength. So uh, there, he will have spells in the game, but right now we need to win games. And he's created two chances. It's also a bonus you get Jordan on board and when he gets a chance he puts it in the back of the net and when you score goals it, it gives you a confidence defensively that if you can see one there's a chance you'll score two and that's that that's where we feel like top end of the pitch they gave us a bit more today um, and, and ultimately we were a bit unlucky with the penalty um, Jack's put his hand down it's hit his hand I suppose it is a penalty he didn't intentionally do it I thought there was a good penalty shout for us first half that we didn't get but that those decisions when you're at the bottom don't go for you. Second half thought we were really good. We played the wind well, got Thiago on the ball, got Jordan in areas where he might hurt them and just got up the pitch. And You mentioned the top end because they scored goals but defensively second half I thought that the boys stepped up and, and when you get 2-1 and you've not been winning and a bit nervous that, that's where you need your centre half and your defenders to stand up and as a back four towards the end there I thought they were excellent. Well, we've had we've had two weeks now in terms of bringing players in. Uh, if you obviously Murph's first game back today made a huge difference in midfield. Uh, Stacey now two games in with us. Beckham now back with us. Um, today it's slightly different because Jordan comes in and you know he's a real goal threat and always scored goals. But I think it's not just the, the players coming in. It is having time with them together as a group. And I think that's the thing that people think you, you come this time of the season you might sign players. Um, but it doesn't just click, it's a lot of hard work. We've put some hard work in the last two weeks. I think that was evident today. We can't just keep signing players. It is a okay, case, because I, I do genuinely believe the players we've got here are good enough. And I'm hoping that the confidence they'll get from a win will, will lift them. But I thought you, I thought we saw second half. Suddenly, Leighton got the winner, he deserved it today. He, 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 as the game went on, got better and better and better because we got better and his confidence then rose. Thiago got better as the game went on. These boys have felt under a lot of pressure for a while and that three points lifts that and they, they don't have the weights on the shoulders. You can see it. We know they're good players but you know we've added a few who aren't lacking in confidence. So the hope is now three points on the board we go again next time.